Thomas Carlyle's birthplace at Eckelfecken is preserved for the nation by the National Trust. But this place is arguably more important. Craig Puffett was a very important place for Carlyle himself. He called it his wild moorland home. And he wrote many of his most significant works there, uh, particularly Signs of the Times, uh, his essay on Burns, and most especially uh, his very famous uh, Sartre Sartus. However, Craig and Puttock has been both literally and metaphorically off the beaten track until now. Uh, this picture shows um, the kitchen at Craig and Puttock. Colin Carter Campbell is only the farm's fourth owner since Thomas Carlyle and his wife Jane lived here 172 years ago. But he's the first actively to encourage people to track it down and visit. I suspect if you spoke to a number of the, the locals in this area, they wouldn't even know that Thomas Carlyle lived here. Um, and which is extraordinary if you think of the significance of a man on a worldwide um, basis. Uh, so um, I, I, I would like that to change and I would like people to come here and, and have the Carlisle experience. Lee Johnston, reporting Scotland, Craig and Puttock.